assisting with assessments. As an RBT, you might find yourself in a position where you're helping a BCBA, a BCABA, or a BCBAD with an assessment. Now, you won't be performing these solo, but sometimes it's better to have the RBT there because you might already have instructional control or have that good rapport. So there are three types or three parts of an FBA, which are direct observation, indirect observation, and a functional analysis. The two really you need to be concerned with is direct observation and indirect observation. Now, I'll give credit to Corey Robertson at Florida Institute of Technology for this, but the way I remember it is the direct observation is the show me method. So you're actually observing the kid and you're watching his behaviors. You're not manipulating anything, but you're just watching and observing. And then the indirect observation is the tell me method. So you interview the parents, you interview teachers, interview siblings, checklists, surveys, things like that. Way less accurate than a direct observation and no assessments complete without direct observation, but an indirect observation is useful to just get an overview of concerns and any behaviors that might be concerning to the family. Now, a functional analysis is when you're actually manipulating antecedents and consequences to determine the function, but we won't get deep into that today.